Hello my friends and welcome to episode 14 of City Skylines. Before we cover anything, I'm going to address the elephant in the room. What happened to episode 13? While I'm talking, I'm going to put an overlay of basically what happened with the recording for episode 13. Uh, basically, I've had some issues regards to what is called an overloading error. That basically comes from OBS and the computer not working in sync. I know what causes the issue, getting a fix is a problem though. Um, so, now that you've seen what the video is basically done, uh, you'll see, well, a couple of seconds of it, you'll see why I didn't upload it. I'm just going to press play. We've got a football match going on. Um, I do expect to win this because we do have a lot of visitors. In fact, we have won it now. There we go. Uh, can I just get off of this now, please? So, as you see, we've got a lot of money for that. Uh, it says 31,000 plus 120,000. Uh, so, Basically what we did is we built this, the Modern Technology Institute, this is the Green Cities DLC equivalent to the university, as you see all our people going out, and you will see by these people going, our subway system is now working, they're all going in there, they're using our pathways nicely, in fact they're all using this pathway rather than that pathway, we've got a few more coming out as well, but you know, good to see them using public transport, and they're waiting at the bus stop as well, quite nicely, showing that the buses are working. So, just to show our metro system, uh, it's not connected to this place yet, uh, the industrial bit. I'm not sure what I'm going to do with that, but either way, right now it is connected to there. Uh, the residential areas and all the commercial areas as well. We've got lines galore. Let's have a look at the lines overview. So, we've got four bus lines. We've got all these so we've got this area unnamed please somebody comment in the comments down below and we will name this residential area across here and um, so we've got dfg which is uh, this place and that stops at three places uh, basically defending the game twisted bard and the unnamed area and sorry it's got four stops i'm curious oh yeah and it stops at the the twisted bard on the way back uh, if you're curious as to why my Twitter is pink, that is basically because of the fix that I've got for OBS. That means that the quality of this video is hopefully slightly better. So we've got all these, basically there's all that. And Main Street is the renamed version of our commercial road that's on this area. I'm calling it Main Street for now. Again, I would like to get a name on this, so if you want to name anywhere, name it down below. They're the two places I'm going to throw up right now. The other discussion I had is this area here, as we see we've got tractor coming in, I'm trying to see if we've got anything else, tractor, tractor, are you a tractor, yes you are, I'm trying to see if we've got any lorries, nope, you're a tractor, you're a lorry, so let's have a look at you, uh, yep, you're an oil truck, um, is it maybe actually just because I've got tweets, no, definitely it's because I'm a fix then, and this is obviously red as well, just hard to put the game onto lower priority through Windows to fix it. The issue, but I'm not seeing any encoding error coming up. Um, but basically, if we look at our districts, this overlaps here, so that's interesting. What I'm going to do is I'm just going to erase district, and I'm just going to trim off this bit here, just to allow higher density, tra uh, big traffic to come in here. Now we've got this here, now I'm not sure why this is here because there was no bus stops or that here, or was there? I'm trying to think, was there now? Did I put a bus stop in there and that's what that's caused that? Um, uh, let's have a look. Lines over with you, buses. Um, Other res to main com. Let's have a view of this line only. Um, because that's the line that I want to have a look at. No, because yeah, that just comes straight through there, so that's fine. Um, I'm very, very confused. Um, what's this ball down trying to place? I've got no idea. Either way, 
that's fine. I don't really know what to do about this. It's saying that there's obviously road ends there, so what I'm going to try and do is just try and just get rid of them and just go from here to here. In fact, does that fix it at all? Nope. Um, but that does seem to be fixing it. I just need to now get rid of it. And as you can see, we've, we're pretty much stuck with it. So anyone that has a fix for that, let me know. Uh, because we obviously deleted that area. And it's not working now. So I'm a bit confused by that. The other thing we've done is we've got a tiny bit of commercial in here, high density. This is all high density now. This is high density. And we have a police station and a fire station in there and I want to get a hospital in here as well so hospital will go in here somewhere I've got space for it absolutely anywhere there we go and what are you you're a sauna I'm not wanting a sauna just now a medical helicopter depot Sports Hall and Gymnasium. We don't have a crematorium yet. That's 17,000. We did hit 20,000. Your community pool. And get off. You are a yoga garden. All the things that you would expect to be in there are in there. So, basically, we've got a hospital. We've got all that good stuff in here. And that's going to cover this area now. We do have quite a lot of demand, so again, I'm just going to stretch across if I can click correctly. And I'm going to just go like so to create that. And we've got another issue here. What's the issue with this? The annoying thing is, is you can't even just click these to find out what's wrong. You know. We can click that, but that doesn't tell us anything other than it's called Amanda Street. What are you doing? Going to work. I mean, they're all waiting here for something. Traffic routes. Nope. So what I think's happened is I've got a, I suspect what's happened is I've got a ghost route basically and I'm gonna I've heard about this from googling but basically that's what I'm suspecting as I would google to confirm uh, but that's the only thing I can suspect of in all honesty what's your issue not enough customers well, that's a bit concerning given that I've got a metro station right there and bus stops right around here somewhere as well here in fact so that's very very concerning what's your issue not enough educated workers I think that symbol is that's a bit of a worry so we've also got a uh, cargo stations and we did unlock an extra square which we bought this one because it allows us to get our industry area that I plan to do all started to get together once we get industrial demand which we're starting to get now but the shit I forgot is the train lines out here as you can see so I can't connect to that and the other thing is I need to get a road that goes from this highway to this highway which again we can't do because we can't reach that highway yet so our outside connections haven't improved uh, by me buying that square so I'm kind of hoping that we get another square soon so we get one at 17,000, then we get our third loan at 22, and then another 36, 48. In fact, actually, after that, we start to get squares every single time. So that might come in a bit handier, in all honesty. I do want one of our train stations to be in here next to the football stadium, just so we can get start getting people in here consistently. Um, I don't want to relocate this building pretty much ever the Scouse Mouse Stadium. Obviously, the districts are going to be called Scouse Mouth North and South, as we have already discussed. And we put a fire station in here just to try and help this industrial area, which kept burning down, basically. 
uh, which was rather frustrating for us. If I can click that button there, that would be smashing. Thank you very much. Um, and I'm pretty sure I emptied this landfill site. Uh, building is emptying. Can I empty you just now as well, please? I mean, the incinerator is right here. It really should be emptying quicker than this. In all honesty, uh, and this does generate electricity as well, which is very, very handy. But I'd be expecting the plants just to go straight down there, straight back up, down. But they're not doing that. They're not emptying at all. It's taken me. As I said, I started done this pretty much fairly early in episode 13 and they're still emptying now. Recycling plants are fine, but they're not getting that um, bonus that I really wanted to get. I'm just going to delete this because we really don't need that anymore. Um, and we've unlocked the hydro dam as well, which I would like to do at some point. I also want to rework this roundabout into sort of several mini roundabouts going on to a big roundabout which I think would look really really nice but it's getting it all together and I want to redo this bridge back into a highway going in each direction um, which will be an interesting build to say the least. Uh, we've got our abandoned building across here let's just get rid of it it is that one there I think there we go make the building next door happy so, again, just get rid of that. I'm going to Google how to fix the uh, ghost route because there's clearly the issue of this ghost route here. Uh, they're clearly waiting on a bus and I suspect that's what's causing that. Traffic here has improved. We upgraded them to high barriers, which is why this area actually got deleted um, in all honesty. So hopefully that will work eventually. The metro system looks very, very crazy because of all the underground paths we've got, which is part of the issue with reworking all this. So what I'm thinking is, is we're going to rework this bit of the highway um, around where the forest is going to be. So if we were to say forest is going to be right up to here. In fact, it's actually not going to be ideal to do that, but trying to work out the best way to work it in all honesty. Um, initially I was going to go underground but then that's going to be a nightmare for Metro uh, to get in and out of the area because if we go page down um, as you can see I had to go around uh, the bits that were here and here because otherwise I couldn't get into uh, I couldn't get in basically because of the underground so I think what we're going to do first is rework this um, in fact let's just get rid of these abandoned buildings first so let's get rid of page up please you uh, any more abandoned here nope you anymore I've seen a few flashes to be honest okay let's get rid of that um, so I'm trying to think the best way to do it is to go around but then that does also mean uh, resume game I didn't mean to do that uh, that does also mean cutting off part of our forestry which isn't a great dense of forestry anyway um, to do that so I guess what we're going to do is we're going to go with it actually let's rock so we're going to take let's get rid of you you and this is an outside connection so we can't really delete any more we're going to take it all the way back I mean, the good thing about this is it's going to mean that we can get on from uh, onto the highway from our industrial areas really, really easily, which 
we'll hopefully save on traffic in this kind of roundabout. And we're going to take it right back. In fact, we're going to go even further back than this. We'll rework. Uh, I kind of don't want to, to go any further back than this just now. Um. Right, see. So yeah, we won't go any further back than this. So, highway. And we want highway. What kind of highway is this? Your four lane, your normal highway. So, what are you? You are a normal highway. And, right, so what we're going to do is we're just going to bring you out. Let's get our thing on just now we're going to bring you out and go around here and up and around here and we want to leave quite a bit, a bit of space actually just for the other road because that has to come back in of course and again just right up to here we're probably going to run out of money doing this I just want to come Whoa, what's this? What is this? What are you? Just a boulder. That's fine. So, again, cut through here. And down here. And then back onto you, like so. And try and follow this as closely as I can. That's not really my specialty, in all honesty. So again, we're just going to bring you round like so, and again, round like so, and round like so, and then bring you back to here, and then from here to here. So that should all reconnect now and work fine. Let's play and make sure. As a uh, doing U turns on highways from the truck, I like it. I'm curious to follow this truck. It's going to create havoc with the traffic that's here already just now. I'd imagine. Um, but we are getting traffic coming away, so that's fine. Um, in fact, it's actually working quite smooth just now. It's killed maybe some traffic. Say it's been flooded with water. What do you mean? Where's our city being flooded? I'm not seeing our city being flooded anywhere. But you know what, that's fine. Uh, how is our areas of empty getting on? There you go, it's done 4% from there to there. I mean, that's just not right, really, is it? It can't be, surely. So, what I want to do is this is going to be our forestry area up here, and this is going to be our farming area here, because farming really close to a city makes all the world a sense but it's going to work out quite nicely for us I think I want to get rid of these treatment things at some point and get a different type of treatment that's going to be more greener um, I'm still struggling to see which building has been flooded by the way but I mean we are building on the banks of this great river we've run out of electric we've got electrical issues once again, and we had this last episode, we did build one. Uh, of course, you're not going to see that, uh, unfortunately. Geothermal is actually fairly decent, but it costs a lot of money. We've got the solar updraft, which generates 240 for 90k. What do you develop? Okay, you're much, much better. Let's go with you. Um, must be played on a, placed on a roadside. Okay. Um, be 
best place to put it just now is probably here then. Um, and that should give us a lot of extra power. Um, and that is the solar updraft tower. What a beauty it is. Um, bit surprised it needs to be placed roadside, I think. Don't think I've actually ever worked with stuff that needs to be placed roadside. As you see, our highway is working quite smooth just now. This roundabout is completely chock a block right now, though. And I, phew, that's horrific at this end. That's been caused by the other end, I think. So I think that's been caused by me deleting that road, putting it back in. That's caused that. Uh, when's the next football match, by the way? That is on the. 17th of the 11th, 2024. Um, so that's quite a bit away. So, yeah. Let's get back to what we're trying to do because we're getting a lot, a lot of demand just now. And what we want to do and is we're going to have a road and train stations that come through here. Uh, the stations will be separate from the main road because you know just to help traffic and hopefully that would work quite nicely so what I want to see is to, let's see if we can get our cargo stations in straight away um, train what's our options cargo station terminal is 60,000 train station multi platform end station multi platform train station train tracks one way train track and train line okay that's fine I mean I know we can't actually connect them outside but I'd like to get them in place because that's the thing that's going to get us going uh, budget loans I did take out these loans actually in the last episode as well I completely forgot about that but repaid this one to take it back out to build the to build something I think it was the modern institute uh, modern technology institute if I'm honest, we've got another abandoned building down here. Um, let's just get rid of you. In fact, that area has been horrifically bothered, in all honesty, uh, by low population. So maybe work on something there. Two visitors, that's not ideal. And we can't get more visitors. I think it was just over seven hundred. We had uh, just over seven hundred. We had for the last match, um, but we need more money, and we do not have any money right now. Um, what's your issue? Not enough educated workers. Well, we're working on that. I mean, we're up to one thousand three hundred and sixty-six university students, and we've got quite a lot of high school students. So, if we go to here. You know, we've got 800 out of 800 there, and there's 1,598 within the actual city itself. Um, we do have some demand for high density residential, and uh, well, for residential, and I'm quite tempted to stick some on this street here, but I actually want to keep these streets quite nice in terms of the way that we build them. So I'm going to build further along. Obviously got all that commercial there. I want to just build some high density nicely here next to our subway and try and cover off some of that issue that we have. And I might eventually switch all this to high density res as well. But I think I need to do that from back to front. Because we've got another abandoned building here. Um, and more undergrounds there as well. Um, can I just go back there and just see where that's actually going? Oh, you're just going to there, that's fine. Um, so, what we want to do eventually, uh, when we've got a bit more money, is get this area built because we ran out of money because we're building stuff that was needed for the city. Genuinely, I can't remember what we built now. Oh, we built that solar updraft for the electricity issue which has now got us um, a lot a lot of electricity so that works out nicely from for us 
the curious if we've got a heating plant here. So we've got a tank reservoir, we've got plumbing service, pumping service rather. Fresh water outlet. Um, eco water treatment plant. So, this is the thing we want. We need to get 60,000 to get that, uh, 36,000 to get that though. Because I've got another abandoned building. Um, page up please keep forgetting I'm going down uh, fire service should be able to get to that fairly that burning building fairly easily uh, I see no reason why they can't get from here across to here very very quickly um, are they on it or am I just seeing things nope I'm just seeing things so that building is going to burn down because our fire service is not very good um, What's our deal with passenger trains? How much are they? They are 45,000 or for terminal 60,000 each. Because um, I would quite like to get, maybe a multi-platform system would be quite useful in here because we could build a train station across here somewhere that would connect to that quite nicely um, and just be like a little shuttle train that goes back and forth. We do have a lot, a lot of traffic. This does seem to be freeing up though, so whatever the issue was, I'm gonna guess it was down to me deleting that highway. And I did want to redo this roundabout today, but what we're gonna do is we're probably gonna do that. In the Actually, let's finish by redoing this roundabout. So let's pause. We've got, let's just pay that back and take it just so we've got a little bit extra uh, to do it. And what would be good, I think, is to take you back, take you back, uh, you off, take you off, take you back. So we'll do the roundabouts now, and then we will do, don't get a refund on these roads now because they're too old. Um, and I want to take you all the way back to here. Um, and in fact that's actually going to become a highway uh, event pretty soon so I'm not going to put too much stress in that and what we want to do is create a little roundabout so just want to go down to oh god damn it right road straight down two and from here along one from here along one and then what I could do from here is then take our barriered highway and now put it back on the curved out one and round out one and round out one and round out one and round not that I think it really matters too much uh, for this and then we can delete that for those refunds and then if we delete this further back again let's go page down actually and just delete all this because we really don't need it page up please there we go again just take you back a little bit more and I want to take you back pretty much to there you back to there in fact I'm actually going to rework all of this pretty much so I want to have it going nice so we've got to get all that that does have to come across and if we go page down we need to bring that across as well but I'm going to keep it like so just now so we actually have no connections to this highway from this roundabout so things are a bit interesting it's gone a bit wob shaped which is okay I guess um, I mean this is maybe the only acceptable one 
um, let's get rid of you and bring you all the way back to here and we'll actually bring you back as well page up and delete so what I want to do is have a little bit of delete please um, a little round about here and what we're going to do is it's going to connect so one two I need to have straight so one to two and then one down one and one up one and again back to our highway and we want you coming round like okay I don't quite know how to work this but we're going to get there back to here back to here this is something that I'm literally just experimenting with right now so I don't know how well it's going to work and then back to here and then we can bulldoze this little bit off here and you can come from here or rather here to here our wonky looking roundabout is going to look even wonkier um, as this works um, and we'll just actually knock this off because it would be nice to go from here but yeah it's going to have to be like that and, that and then we can just delete these for that little refund and then again I just want a little road that comes from here out to uh, give me a straight and then from here out one and from here out one and again let's get back to our highway and just curve to and then out and again just deleting this bit here this bit here this bit here and this bit here just to get it going right and then out like so and then you come into this like not like that anyway and then from here out from here out like so and then again delete this 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 and this and then another one on this side so out two straight out one one and again let's just delete this 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 and then again back to this I want to go back to curved like so like so like so and like so let's quickly delete that 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 and that get this all connected back up that's going to work just about and then you out like so and then hopefully if this works as planned you'll come out like here and go to you'll come out like here you'll come out here go like so you'll come out here like so this won't look like this eventually and um, you'll come in here like so and it'll come out from here like so and then 
what we want is I'm actually just going to stick with this but I'm with it like this go from here onto it here and page up please you can come over like a show just need to get it over so if we can go to say here and then just give me it over you're going to give me a space somewhere aren't you just need to get that into there somewhere it's not going to work is it The gap just too big maybe. Just need to get it over oh it went blue briefly. There we go. And then you can come back down. But it doesn't even need to be that big if we can take go to there back out and then back onto this can almost have it straight coming down straight like that and just straight back on into here like so um, and then from this roundabout coming off here kind of like so and again from here can we just get a nice right let's just come out straight because so why can't I come out this way then see if I can delete delete that come out straight here and I bet you I could come in here no I can't so that doesn't work either so And then another one I guess here then page up curve tool well actually page down and we'll actually go page down this time about here and then round here and I'm going a complete wrong way and we're going to run out of money before we fix this that's going to suck um, is there any way we can get more money? No. Okay, let's quickly fast forward this because this is going to create havoc otherwise. In fact, we're actually ran completely out of money. Um, let's see how it's going to work because right now it's not going to work at all. We know that because it's not complete basically but we need to get back onto this highway before um, we get sorted um, and the traffic right now is going to be a nightmare uh, as it learns what it's doing um, let's go back to our highways Essentially the price difference between that and that. 70 SL, 90 SL. So we want to go from here, round here, connect back up here. Does that work? Yeah, so let's go page down again. And we're just looking to get another few thousand to get to about here need another couple of thousand come on come on game there we go and then from here we can just nicely get back on here somewhere page up 
Uh, we need 11,000 for that, so we just need a little bit more money. This episode's going on a little bit longer than I wanted it to, but I've always had to explain what happened in the last episode. Come on. Come on, game. In fact, the traffic actually looks a lot worse. And the traffic's dying as it's coming into there as well. But it's maybe just because it's been in the wrong lane and not realised. So, we'll see. Keep an eye on that as it comes on. Come on, come on game. Just need a little bit more money. Just a, kind of bring it back out just a touch earlier. There we go. I mean, I want just a nice curve back onto it. There we go. So that's that bit done. And then, what type of road is it we've got under here? It's is it off ramps. Are you an off ramp? That's the question I have. Uh, page up. Or are you just a one way street? Let's just do that. You are in off ramp, so we're using off ramps. Two way highway, two way highway, sound barriers for that road, and that's an in off ramp. So, what we're going to do is just bring you down straight away. Construction cost, and then I want to bring you across to here. And you're going to come out onto. Um, need more money come on we need just a few extra thousand and I want to bring you up actually nope I want to bring you up here so then if I go page no page down page up there we go that'll work and now this should be working nicely and it sh should hopefully see an improvement to this uh, in the next episode which then means we can now get on with that residential uh, industrial area we've got all that industrial demand this traffic now starting to work um, which is actually quite frustrating because it's all coming in here um, and we're using basically one lane of our road when if it used all three do the exact same thing and be better so that's the issue that we've got here is basically laning is now a problem uh, hopefully this will correct itself over time and work more efficiently than the single roundabout I mean it looks horrible right now I've not built it to any level of professionalism by any stretch of the imagination I don't even get why they're switching lanes here like if you see that car there it drove right around here in the middle lane and then switched lanes but the only lane it can turn there is left apparently not they're all right turn it's only one left turn lane do you know what like see oh we hit 17,000 which means we get another square yay that's going to help us in the next episode so let's see if we can delete that see if that fixes that issue um, and we can delete that and we could make this look a lot nicer as well this one will be a bit more needed um, but again this bit here we don't need so we can actually make this look a lot nicer now but hopefully that will see them using every lane because they can only use one lane at a time now and um, which as you can see the ones that are using the middle lane are the ones getting the best service basically um, and hopefully over time that means that they realize that now because they're not using roads that they don't actually need to use excuse me Anyway guys, on that very weird looking um, ending, in fact, 
do you know what we could actually maybe do is actually just go here out to here here to here to here and here to here I think that's the way you're made, maybe meant to do it and hopefully that will actually get it running a bit nicer now as well because again that doesn't actually change the lanes it just changes a couple of the lanes so they're only coming into these roundabouts if they actually need to uh, but as you see three lanes getting used here so that's nice I guess and only the cars that need to turn off here will actually turn off everyone else will come through this lane that sneeze is really affecting my voice. Anyway guys, this has been a much longer episode than planned. So I'm going to pause the game, end the episode here. Thank you so much for watching. I hope you enjoyed. If you did, hit like, hit subscribe, and I'll hopefully catch you all next time.